Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. You're probably wondering why I'm holding my neck. It's <laughs> no, 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 no. Because there's a massive wet patch here and I really don't want you to judge me. But I need to start this vlog now. So I've got no time to wait for it to dry. But this vlog, as you can tell from the title, is going to be a mix of a couple of days. Today we are picking up our new car. I'm way too excited for this. We are literally about to head there now, so I'm gonna be really quick with this intro, but that is gonna be the first half of this vlog. And then later on this week, I'm going to an event with Lounge. We're celebrating their third birthday, which is insane. So I'm going for a really nice dinner with them in Birmingham with a load of other girls that you may recognize the faces of. I'll also be vlogging that and I'm just gonna include it in this vlog and make it like a weekly type thing. But yeah, right now I'm just putting together a couple of returns that I need to take to the post office on our way to get the car. But we're also gonna grab Brad's little brother Callum to come and get the car with us because he's as excited as we are. Then we're picking up my brother later because he's coming back here for dinner. So we're basically picking up a car and using every excuse we have to go and drive it around pretty normal. But yeah, that is what's happening today. So I will probably pick you back up when we are doing our last drive in my little A1, which is going to be so sad. So for my outfit, please just excuse all of the stuff in the background. I've just finished filming a Pretty Little Thing haul. I'm just wearing this oversized Pretty Little Thing jumper again. You would have seen this in the Amsterdam vlogs, but I'm just obsessed with it. And to be honest, I live in it. Then I've got these jeans on, which I've just picked up in the Pretty Little Thing haul that I've just filmed. That haul will be up by the time this vlog goes live, most likely. So I'll leave it linked down below. Because I also picked up these trainers, which quite obviously are Balenciaga dupes and in my opinion they're pretty good ones. Also they're not like insanely heavy, I know that the actual Balenciagas are like honestly a workout on your feet. So yeah I'm really happy with these and this is my new car picking up outfit. That's not a thing but I've just made it a thing. I can't believe this is the last time I'm driving my car. Great parking by the way. Oh, Which is, oh my god. Car. This is the car that I've had for three years, a load of you guys have always asked me and it's an Audi A1. Great little cards, but time for an upgrade. <laughs> okay, so we're in the new car. How do we turn this down? Um, I'll talk more about it later and properly show you guys it later, but I'm doing the most important part right now putting up our air fresheners because these two don't like the Stink. smell of a new car. They don't they? That's good though. Nice. This is Callum by the way. He's never been on my channel before. This is Brad's little brother. Um, I want to do a video with you two where you choose my outfit. It's been a pretty little thing. <laughs> do you not think that would be funny? I think it'd be funny. Anyway, I'm gonna put you guys there and decide where to put these. Wait, I'm gonna put my fancy one up there. Problem is they're all different smells. Are they waiting to come in here, by the way? <gasps> My seat's getting warm. How do you turn your steering wheel on that? Yeah. There's some now, look. Oh, look how cute. Oh, God, it stinks. Oh, your door is open. Oh, sorry. Ooh. Should I put this guy up here? That's going to be annoying. Break hard. It's gonna <laughs> he was smashing there. Do you want to put one of them in the back? You can change device really quickly as well. <laughs> can you put it in there? Right there. Yeah, hook it on there. And then close right, it again. Yeah. Okay. okay, so we're now going to head off and grab my brother. Done. Callum's trying to put the air freshener in the back and is having a very hard time with that. Yes, yeah, so we're going to go and grab Ollie, who is my older brother, and then head back home. And I think we're all just going to have dinners together, but I will properly show you the car when we get home. It's very exciting. I'm very proud of us. Are you proud? Yeah. Are you happy? Yeah, very much so. Good. So yeah, this is our new little baby. And we're banning everyone from eating in it. So Callum wants a McFlurry and we're going to make him stand outside the car to eat it. My middle left right. Okay. Oh, that's so Ready, one, two, three, go. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Okay, so it is now Thursday. Excuse the fact that I've literally just woken up. But I'm travelling to... My new favourite thing apparently is to vlog in front of the mirror. But today I'm travelling to Birmingham to go to the lounge event to meet the girls for dinner. Which I'm so excited about, but I'm honestly running a little bit late already. It's going to take me three hours to get there. So I've obviously gone for ultimate comfort in my outfit. So I'm wearing this white hoodie from I Saw It First. Trusted Jamie jeans and then the same trainers that I was wearing at the start of this vlog. And these are from Pretty Little Thing. My case is all packed. Bonnie is... I don't know if she's sad that I'm going but she hasn't left my side this morning it's weird i feel like dogs always know when you're going somewhere but yeah i realize that i haven't showed you guys the car yet i'm honestly like obsessed with it me and brad keep shotgun driving rather than shotgun not driving <laughs> so of course i will show you guys when i go out to it but i thought i would just say good morning and i hope you're having a good day so far whatever time you're watching this but yeah i need to head off now so i'm gonna head downstairs with all of my stuff i've definitely got way too much for one night away i mean if you can pack lightly then i feel like that's an actual life skill so Let's go. Okay, so here's the car. This is our new little pride and joy. We went for a Range Rover Evoque and this is what the inside looks like. I mean, it's a car, like you can Google this stuff. I don't need to show you so much of it, but yeah, at the moment it's obviously pristine. We're trying to just keep it as clean as we possibly can. So yeah, this is the new car, but I am now about to make my way to Tesco first of all, and then I'll be on the road on the way to Birmingham. So in all honesty, I'll probably just pick you back up when I'm in the hotel and I'll show you my room and everything. Okay, so I've just made it into my room. I know there's been a little bit of a jump from me being at home in the car to now being here. I wish I actually traveled that quick because it definitely wasn't quick at all. It took me around three and a half hours to get here, but it's a pretty straightforward drive and driving a new car is always nicer anyway. So I'm not complaining about it, but this is my room. I'll give you a quick little room tour. Please excuse the fact that I've literally just dumped my bag. Like, I mean, I feel like we all do that. So please don't judge me, but this is the room. There's a mirror over there. Hi. I'm about to pop out to Tesco Express to grab myself a sandwich because I haven't eaten all day. But anyway, there's some mirrors on the wall here, a mirror over there, a little desk area, and then the bed area there. I'm not going to show you the view for now because I want to save that till later. But then there's also a full length mirror here. I've just switched up my outfit a tiny bit and I mean, I've literally just put a bodysuit on instead of my hoodie because it's actually such nice weather. This coat, by the way, I will leave it linked down below. It's from Pretty Little Thing. All of the details will be in the description. And there's a TV on the wall here. And and then in this corner we have a wardrobe which is really funky actually little dressing gown there's two dressing gowns in there but i'm on my own and then the mini bar which i think is free and that makes me happy because how many times nowadays do you get a mini bar and you have to pay like 10 pound for a bar of chocolate some crisps up there just your normal stuff that you find in a hotel room and then the bathroom is in here again really bog standard everyone knows what a bathroom looks like but the best part of this room if you have been here since we lived in london and you knew what our view looks like from our london flat it literally has nothing on this view from this hotel room look at the view from the window like what the hell <laughs> i feel like i can see for miles like I don't know about anyone else, but I'm obsessed with amazing views because I just love watching what's kind of going on. Like, I'm such a people watcher anyway. But especially at night when all the lights come on, I just think views are the nicest things to just sit and stare at. Like, I could honestly do it all day. Does that make me sound weird? I don't know. Let me know if you can relate. But this, yeah, is my ridiculous view from the room. I'm on the 24th floor. But also, it's such a nice day here. Like, it's so sunny and warm and it's just putting me in the best mood. Like I say, I'm now just going to pop to Tesco and grab myself a little bit of food and and then I'm gonna come back here and probably start like slowly getting ready. I need to be ready for about quarter to eight is when we're meeting in the restaurant, which is literally just over to the right. So I've got plenty of time. Okay, so I'm now ready to go. This is what my face and my hair looks like. And then I'm just wearing this blazer dress, which is from Rebellious. It is a little bit short, but I have cycling shorts underneath and we're literally sitting down for dinner. So I'm not too worried about it. This is what the view looks like at night. It's honestly like, Incredible, I could just sit here and stare at it the whole time. But yeah, the room is a tip, so please don't mind that. This is what my outfit looks like in full. I'm about to go meet up with Kate because I just realized that she's here as well. We literally just messaged each other what we're wearing and we're pretty much wearing the same thing. So we're gonna look like twins. But yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to take my camera with me just because obviously it is like a sit down dinner and I don't really wanna shove a camera in people's faces, but I will, I'm sure, be putting stuff on my Instagram story. So I will insert all of those clips now and then I'll catch up with you guys when I'm back in the room. So as you can probably 
probably tell from my lack of filming and lack of stories. I just got way too involved in conversations with the girls that I've spoken to so much online, but never actually met in person. So it's so nice to just sit down and have dinner with some amazing people and just get to know them all. But it was honestly an insane event. Like all of the girls at lounge did so, so well with the decor and everything. Like all the food was amazing. This place is incredible. So yeah, I just feel really honored to have been a part of this event. And I'm so happy that I finally met the girls. They are literally the nicest people ever. But as you can probably tell, I'm now back in the room. So I'm going to just try and clear all of this stuff. I know there's a lot. Off the bed and then finally get myself into bed. It's about half 12. And I think I'm just going to get up reasonably early in the morning. And then head to breakfast with a couple of the girls. And then make my way home. I've got a lot of stuff to get done when I'm home. As I have a very busy weekend. Which will also be in this vlog. But I'm going to see Georgia and Misha at the weekend. Which is going to be so exciting. And I can't wait to go on a night out with them. Because I feel like it's just so long awaited. And now it's finally happening. But yeah, I'm going to end this section of the vlog here. And just head to bed. Because I'm so tired. Morning guys, so I've just woken up and again, this is my view this morning. It's just insane. I slept with the curtains open because I was just staring at the view all night. So the sun woke me up this morning and it's just like the best way to wake up. But yeah, I'm now off to meet Nelly and then we are gonna go to some breakfast and then I think I'm just gonna get on the road to get home because I've got so much stuff that I need to get done before the weekend. But yeah, I'll show you what I have for breakfast. <laughs> So I've just got back from breakfast. I'm now just packing up my room. I'm about ready to go. I'm really sad to leave this place. I've had such a nice time. I think I might pick up Brad on the way home because he's traveling back from London today. So I'm sure I'll meet up with him. But yeah, I'm gonna be saying goodbye to this room, which is so sad. I wish I could take this view with me. I mean, you guys have probably seen enough of it. Okay, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> So I'm starting today's part of the vlog pretty late. You haven't missed anything. I've literally just been sat in the car for two hours driving back into London. I was in Birmingham yesterday. I got home, didn't even unpack my stuff and just like added some things to my case. And now I've bought the same case here because... I just didn't have time to sort anything out. So I'm now back in London. I'm at the moment where Georgia lives. I'm leaving the car here and then I'm getting train into London to meet her and Misha at an event that we're meant to be going to. She's literally sending me like 20 messages at once. I'm going to meet them at an event, which I'm really, really late for, but we're then going to go for food after and then come back here. And then we're hopefully going to film some videos together because we are heading out tonight. I feel like I just need a good drink. I've done way too much driving and sitting in the car. I need to be like out in the fresh air enjoying myself so yeah that is our plan for today but right now i need to go and pay for this car park and grab myself a train ticket sexy everything about me's not sexy what are we doing we haven't even had a drink hi we have i mean a small one i mean a tipple two tipple and a half and a half Oh, that's not even a song. Just like chilling on the towel, isn't that? Are you fine? <laughs> the Kappa ones, yeah. really sorry, no, just fine. slam it. Just only because we're going to be saying very rude things. <laughs> I've got the shot. Oh, I hit record by, by accident. Do you by accident? <laughs> we're bright. Do we need to move back? Also, oh, I'm sorry, I love you guys, but this is close. <laughs> All over you again. Really, Mum? <laughs> really? <laughs> I just got a new sister, you know. What? So funny. No, we've got no, Georgia and Emily here. Okay, sorry, I didn't mean to blank you off. Hold on, let me just go back to my... Okay, we need to go. Love you lots. Bye. Okay. Why have you got a shiny nose? <laughs> it's called Highlight. Bye, love you, bye. Bye, mama. We need to go. Love you, bye. Daddy, control yourself. Bye. <laughs> Hi, guys, and welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I'm not alone in today's video. <laughs> I'm a lovely... <laughs> yeah. Can you see? <laughs> I've got Misha Grimes and Georgia May on my Hi channel guys. today. Hi. You already know Georgia. Misha's not been on my channel before. No, hi, I'm new. <laughs> We've literally just met today. But I know, I it's think fine. Things are going well. So. Yeah, so far, just you know. Just call me matchmaker. First, <laughs> first date's nerves, they're all good. <laughs> so, today, as you can tell from the title, we are going to be doing mm. a Say It or Shot It video. <laughs> you say it's choking on alcohol. Mm. <laughs> you literally sounded like an elephant. No, I was drinking it and I was oh. like, oh. We are about to head out, but I'm not going to lie, we don't want to be on the floor tonight. So, we're having sour. <laughs> like, I know people are shot in vodka and stuff. I know, no. I'm sorry. These, like, respect to these girls out there that do it, but I can't. Like, I can't have seven shots of vodka and then go on a night No, out. if it was, like, two shots, I'd be good. Same. But more, no. Okay, I've got a good one. Whoa. Here we go, shots ready. Ready Let's that. get ready. Like. Have you ever liked a friend's brother? Question mark. I can actually answer this. Um, and I can actually say, 
No, I haven't ever liked a friend's <laughs> but brother. But does that mean that we need to then take a shot? Yeah, how does I that work? I guess we should take one anyway. We could take one anyway. Mm. But Do you I'm take one if you're guilty it. or take one if you're not guilty? You take one if you don't want to answer the question. I mean, I'll but answer it and need... take a shot. How do I pour this without getting it all over the carpet? And how much do I pour? Just a shot. Yeah, but do I, I feel like I don't fill it up. Is that enough? Um, okay. Is that too little? Do I put more? She's kind. <laughs> so the question oh, was, sorry, no. have you ever liked a friend's brother? For me, the answer's no. No, I don't think... Ah! Uh, no. No, like, not properly liked. I mean, I've poured myself the biggest I shot, mean, yeah. so I think that calls guilty. <laughs> oh! Oh my god, that's so sugary! I bet that's like your daily sugar intake. <laughs> isn't that? Probably. But this is why I'm like vodka is a better call, but <sighs> I just don't want to be on the floor. Last time you stalked your you ex. Guys are gonna shot this. I don't have an ex. You leave me out. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't Last time you stalked your ex. Are you gonna Are you gonna answer that or are you gonna? Um, answer that. Yeah, I'll answer that. Maybe like. Two weeks ago. I say about two weeks ago as well. Really. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say about two weeks ago. Oh my god, I really hope that they don't I was watch showing this. someone. One of their <laughs> friends is gonna watch this. No. Check in. Check in, hope they're alright. I know that you two aren't gonna answer this question. Okay. Oh god. Okay, let me get the sounds ready. <laughs> I, I can put it if you want me. On your phone, who was the last guy that you texted? What their name? <laughs> Give me a shot now. Their name? <laughs> yeah. Oh I can say their name. The last guy I texted is my friend Ben. <laughs> that was the last boy I texted. I don't think Misha's answer. I think I'm just going to do this anyway because it's in front of me. I feel like does my dad count? No. <laughs> don't need that. What's you? Brad. Oh. Yeah, no, it was Brad. That's really boring. Sorry about having a boyfriend. <laughs> I love how the question in which I just didn't want to answer my mum has actually asked. <laughs> I know. Okay, name a YouTuber that you would hook up with. Why do we all look at me? <laughs> okay, let's think about this. I think it's really difficult because I don't watch a many British guys. A British YouTuber or just a YouTuber? Any. But I hook up with what? See, everyone fancies like the Dolan twins, but they're not a bit of me. Oh, I do have a bit of a soft spot. They're for not a bit of me. They're quite cute. No, but then is I it like hook up, hook up with in the sense that you want to be in a relationship with them, or you're just like want to sit with them? them? Who's like a fit British YouTuber? Shoot, that's bad that we can't think of any. I know. That we don't know any I only British watch YouTubers <laughs> that we. Yeah, I just watch. See, I watch a lot of YouTube. But not guys. Yeah, I do, but I just don't fancy any of them. Oh my, the only UK, UK YouTubers I can think of is like Adam Waith, yeah. Joe Weller. Who else? Who else exists? I love her. What other guy YouTubers are there? I can't no, think of any. No. This is savage. Come on, there must can be. Can we comment down below with right. boy YouTube? <laughs> yeah, let us know good looking British boy YouTubers that me and George will steer clear of because we know YouTubers aren't a good idea. <laughs> well, I don't know that. <laughs> well, <laughs> you can learn from my experiences. <laughs> Tea. We just keep answering the questions and shotting. That's not the game. <laughs> well, we can't answer them. And I feel like it's unfair if we're just like, and we can't answer them. I need to burp. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> oh. I'm going to keep this in because I know you're not going to answer it. Come Name on. the last person you had sex with. I'm going to drink. I'm not going to answer <laughs> I'm going to drink. I just like came out with some random <laughs> name. <laughs> not my boyfriend, this random guy that I met at the pub. I would admit it, but if it wasn't ah, that person, ah, you know what I mean? that person. Because it gives away everything. Thing. Everything. Yeah. Okay, so as you can probably tell from the background, I am at George's. We've been here for a good four hours So now. much has changed. <laughs> Misha's here. We've finally Hi. met. It's been the longest time. Yeah, so we're... Hey, guys. Now, George is here. We're now about to... We did try and film a sale and shot it. <laughs> we did actually Maybe film. Maybe include mini clips yeah. Maybe include yeah. some little clips. I'll yeah. include whatever we got out yeah. of that video, but... We're basically just gonna have like a massive girly day soon and just film loads of videos for you guys that will actually be of interest. So we're now about to head out. I probably won't take you guys. Do we need us. cash? Because I've got no cash. No. Okay, thank goodness. No. Morning guys and welcome back to another vlog. It's currently half six in the morning. I'm never usually up at this time, but I am currently off to the train station. Brad is very kindly dropping me there. But yeah, I'm heading into London today. I'm off to meet Georgia and then we are going to a shop style event. I think we're heading to one of the cow shed stores. I think we're going to the one in Soho for a couple of massages and some breakfast, which I'm so excited about. But obviously I'm just gonna be sitting on a train for the next two hours. So I'll probably just pick you guys back up when I'm actually in London and with Georgia. Right, so I'm here with Georgia. I've literally jumped from like being in the car in the station to being here. Well, because you had to run, like to be fair, we had to have our massages. Oh. We had to be at the place. <laughs> <laughs> he was so interested. Um, we had to be there at nine. 
Yeah, and I'm never early to so anything. So I feel like that is, and you've got to come a bit of a way. Like, yeah. So fair enough, you were running around, you know True. what I mean? George always is great at making excuses for me. But anyway, we <laughs> have had, we've had our little massages. We basically just went and met the girls from Shop Style and went into the cow shed shop. It's like a spa shop, isn't it? Like, yeah. Treatment and you can buy stuff. Yeah, which is so nice. Oh my god, okay, so we got given these goodie bags, which cute, it's got like little cow shed products in, we've got a little, what's this? Oh, oh it's got cute. a soft style on it. Little notebook, there's a glam glow, oh, no, there's face not. mask, oh, yeah. Piece, and we do them yeah. when we get back to yours. 100%, 100%. That'd be so funny, I've never tried one of them. And then, I was like, oh, what's in here? What's like, in here? is it a gift box? It's from Blondie's Kitchen, which by the way, do the best cookies I've in the world. Tried. Look at this. It's got my freaking name on I there. think that's so cute. How cute is that? And I mean, that's the that's bigger than my head. Like, that's the biggest cookie. We've just said that we're going to go for breakfast, but I mean, mine's right here. George is currently oh, looking. <laughs> she like filmed a load of stuff in the spa, and she's trying to find some good music to put over the top yeah. of it for her Instagram story. But she's literally like making people want to pee with this water noise. <laughs> that's what it sounds like. It just sounds like running water like the whole time. We feel like this is quite dangerous because we've now just started our day with a massage, and now I want to do that every single day. Same. Because I just feel, well, to be fair, I feel ready to do nothing, but. It was amazing. Yeah, it was so nice. So, thank you to the shop store girls. Look like how fluffy my top is. We're a mess. We're like. a bit of a mess. <laughs> we are, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, we're just off Carnaby Street, so I think we're gonna go and find somewhere nice to have some breakfast. Yeah, I need a coffee. So I only want to drink half my coffee, so. I know, so we're feeling good. a little bit tired. Yeah, yeah, we need to go get food. So. Yeah. So that's what we're gonna do. Grab some food and then we're gonna film later. So we're gonna have yeah. batch of G's. I'm not going home until like much later. So we've got the whole day to chill, which oh, is so nice. nice. God, I'm actually a mess. Look at this top. Don't wear a black top with a white cardigan. It's not a look. But yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So I'll probably show you guys where we go. Okay, that guy's staring at me. Okay, bye. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I've gone for X Royale. Unreal. They look that looks amazing. Though, I yeah. know, and it smells amazing. That looks so good. I've had these before. There's some sort of cream in it or something. And it's, it's really good for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're just in Primark. What do you think about, <laughs> what do you think about this? I quite like this. <laughs> I don't think it goes with my hair. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no, she's going You know that lady from Mary Poppins? It's a crazy bag in her. It feeds the birds. Yeah, that's you. That's what this whole outfit is like right now. Like, look at me. I'm like, I'm literally walking the street. Oh my god. Right, let's get that old. Okay, so. Everybody's just being stupid, everyone. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to have to vlog like this because I can't vlog in public and people stare. So enjoy our vlog. Hi. <laughs> wow, look at my hair. <laughs> I'm literally crying. We had a massage. We're going a bit uh, crazy. What do you mean we had a massage? That's why my hair looks like this. No. We're um we're just shopping for some hauls whilst also going a bit mad because we've had a really chilled morning. We, we sat in the Ivy for like five hours. Literally five hours. Um, but yeah, we're just in Primark trying to find some cute things and it's proving kind of difficult at the moment, I'm not going to lie. But we'll keep you posted. And I'm in an Uber on the way to King's Cross because we didn't want to walk. We literally have so much stuff. Like we're actually surrounded by shopping. The weather as well is yeah, and the weather's not, not hideous. Nice. And yeah. everyone gives you paper bags now, which is great for the environment, but they don't fare well with water. Not at all. Um, we nearly split about three <laughs> bags. <laughs> so we're about to head back to George's and then film two hauls and two more videos. But first, we're going to go to the garage so you guys can come there with us. Oh, yeah, let's get snacks. I'm oh, like dreaming. A bit peckish now, which I feel like all they've seen us do is eat, so I'm a bit embarrassed about that. Yeah. It's so all we really do, to be fair. Is eat and chat. Yeah. And then maybe film a couple of videos. <laughs> if we get time. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to grab the train back to George's and then I'll probably just pick you up when we're back there. So we got back from George's about an hour ago. We've had some food. We're now just sitting here staring at our cookies because I really want to eat mine. Like, this looks insane. Like, it's bigger. Lift it up in front of your head. No, it's definitely not bigger than my head, but on my head. <laughs> It might be bigger than yours on most people. How incredible. Like, this is one giant cookie. Ooh. Are you going to eat some? I am going to eat some. Yeah, same. I'm going to boomerang it and then I'm going to eat some. Okay, so we're meant to start filming right now, but... No, no, we were meant to start filming. No, 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 let's just be serious. We were probably meant to start filming, like, what, four hours ago? Sorry, it was out of focus, but yeah. Maybe five. <laughs> literally, not now. It's, like, five o'clock. Is it? It's literally five o'clock. We've got I've got to sort myself out and film two videos. We literally talk too much, like I don't know where time goes. I know me neither, this happens to us all the time though. No. But yeah, we're just gonna sort ourselves out. By that I mean sit on the bed and eat a cookie. Cookies, because priorities, guys. <laughs> food is... Life? Yeah, I felt like that was food is mood or something that would go a bit better than that. Basically just prioritize food. <laughs> yeah. This vlog will probably be out on my channel before 
the hauls. So we're doing a Primark one and an H&M one. Mm -hmm. I haven't shopped an H&M for the longest time. But they actually had some really nice stuff. They we did. went to the one on Regent Street and it's massive. Like there's literally about five. There's literally about five floors. So we spent way too much money in there. But we're basically just going to do like joint hauls on each other's channel. So yeah, that's what we're about to do. And then potentially film a QA and a if we have time. Which we probably won't. But that's our plan for the next couple of hours. We're supposed to start. We need it. <laughs> so I've literally just finished editing this vlog. And I realised how abruptly this ended. I literally didn't film an ending to it whatsoever. So I wanted to just jump on here and say goodbye basically. If you did make it to the end, please let me know down in the comments. And let me know what your thoughts of this kind of like weekly vlog i want to say was but i know it was just like so all over the place trust me i'm getting there i'm getting used to it but i love just bringing you guys in a bit more on my life and what i get up to day to day so if you do want me to do more vlogs then please just let me know and i'll be sure to do that for you guys but that being said i'm gonna wrap this video up here so thank you guys so much for watching as always and i will speak to you all in my next one bye guys